Hello and welcome. In the last video, we had a discussion about the introduction to CocoaDB and Python, how Python is used for RTL verification with the help of CocoaDB. And we saw a two cross one multiplexer example. And in that, I have mentioned that with this initial begin block, we are dumping a file to see the function. But uh, unfortunately, in the last video, I forgot to show you how you can see the waveform over here. So the same test bench, same test is here, same design and same make file over here. I'm just here walking. I just walk you through here how you can see the waveform using GTKB. Okay. So for running a test, just we need to type make over here and you can see the output will present or output will appear here so it's passing right so if we want to see the waveform for the same for that we have to type gtk wave and enter here this window will appear here from file we have to use open new tab and recent is coco tv where the dump file is there dump dot vcd okay so as you can see here we have mentioned dump.vcd okay so the same name will be appear so open this after selecting and you will find this two cross one multiplexer will be here double click over here you will find some signals over here control a and then append these signals over here and just you can you know minimize and maximize the things and you will find a waveform will appear in here. and you can verify the things whenever input a and b are zero and select line is unknown output will be zero okay and whenever a is one select is equal to one output will be one okay so whenever a is one and select is equal to zero y will be b okay select b so output will be b is equal to zero so output will be zero so similarly you can verify the rtl using that python test and you can see the waveform over here using gtk so with this i hope you have understood how you can see the waveform in gtk view which already we have written in python and coco so thanks for watching this video thank you